Hi, this is Kerry with Multicopter Warehouse and the DJI Colorado store. And today we're taking a look at DaVinci Resolve. And what I'm going to show you today will work in both 12.5 and the uh, version 14. What I'm going to do is do a little sky correction. Now, if I'm looking at this first clip here, there's actually some nice blue in the sky. But a little bit later, about 20 minutes later, the sky had gone pretty white because of the exposure there. So I want to fix that up and normally if I'm just trying to, well let's create a new node to work with. So I'm going to do Alt S or Option S. If I just try and fix my, my blues and the highlights, it's, it's affecting everything. And that's not necessarily what I want. I want to limit it to just the sky. So we're going to go to the qualifier tool, which is the little eyedropper. I'm going to be on HSL, which is Hue, Saturation, and Luminance. Make sure that this first target eyedropper is selected. And I'm just going to select the sky. Now, if we look at that node over here on the right, we can see that it created a mask based on that. So that's what's going to be edited now. Now, if I go and I kick my blues up there, I can watch that first thumbnail there and try and get that sky to match pretty closely to that blue. So at least I've got some color instead of it being just completely washed out and white. Now if I want to go ahead and make other adjustments in here to like some of these rocks, I'm going to create another node. Again, I'm going to go back to my qualifier and I can just select this red. And you can see over there on the node that that red is selected. I can go back to my correction tool and I can kick that red up. Let's, let's play around with that and really bump that color up a little bit in all the different angles. Now we can see what I've done. I can totally desaturate it. I can really increase the saturation. I want it to look fairly natural but I really want that red to pop. So I kind of like that right about there. I think that looks really good. So that is using the qualifier tool to do simple color changes on specific colors. So you can turn someone's green shirt into red, things like that. But it's going to affect you know, the entire frame of anything that's color. Now, if we want to just isolate it, we can create power windows around here so it doesn't affect the rest of the screen. But we'll get more into that later. But as you can see, it's done a pretty good job of matching that sky with just a very simple correction using the qualifier and the HSL mode. So that's it. Very short, quick, and easy tutorial today. Hope you enjoyed it. Stick around for more. Subscribe to our channel. Come in and visit us at multicopterwarehouse.com or the DJI Colorado store in Lone Tree, Colorado. This has been Kerry. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you next time.